Hello and how's everyone doing? Welcome back to the channel. If you're a first time visitor, thanks for stopping by. Uh, consider hitting that subscribe button. I'd like to have you as a full time viewer of my channel here. So I have this Huina Bulldozer. This is the Huina 569 116th 8 channel little bulldozer. And it's uh, mostly plastic. It does, I do believe these arms right here might be metal. And the uh, trencher blade is, and for some odd reason, the, the roof cap. Not sure sure why they chose that, but it adds a little bit of weight, so that helps. Now, I picked this thing up. It's uh, fairly new to the market. I had to order it from China. It took about a month to get here. And I've just been looking for an affordable bulldozer that will actually move a little bit of dirt and do some stuff for me. So I came up with this. Uh, it's a really good looking little unit. You look at all that there. And it does uh, have a 600 milliamp rechargeable light, uh, lithium ion battery that's uh, right in the front here. It's a little guy right there with, a, well, I do believe, a JST connector, a little red JST connector. Yep. And that all fits in there pretty nicely, and that actually works out really good for me because I have lots of these exact batteries. They're the same ones that come with the uh, older high-boxing 118 scale trucks. And it did come with the, the radio. It takes two double A's in the back. And these would be your functions for your blade in the front, and these are your functions for the trencher in the back. And... Both these sticks operate the forward and backwards. And they did uh, also include a little charger and a set of instructions that are pretty much all Chinese. But that's all right. It doesn't take long to figure this stuff out. Um, I would have done an unboxing, but this thing literally arrived in a styrofoam clamshell with so much tape on it, it took me five minutes to cut it open. I'm going to fire it up and uh, give you a little demonstration of what it does and uh, on the desk here. And I'll take it outside to uh, the indoor course before I tear it down for the summer and uh, run it there. So I'm going to turn the radio on. Your on and off switch is located in the back. Uh, you can turn the sound off, which is what we're going to do for the video. Uh, just your basic... And then you got your trencher. Now, if you do hold that in for too long, like a lot of the other Huina stuff, it will click. And then you got the blade up and down, which they give you the up and down button, but it just recycles if you just hold one in anyway. So I guess you don't really need that second button, but it works. So, I am going to turn the sound back on so you can hear what it sounds like when it's moving. Let's get this thing out and uh, try it on some dirt.
Well, not too bad for a $120 dozer. I'm going to go ahead and leave a, a link. There's still some of these available on eBay. I don't know how long the link will be active. I imagine until they sell out. But uh, I'm pretty happy with it for the money. Uh, there's a lot of really bad bulldozers out there. And only a couple good ones. This one falls somewhere in the middle. You, it's actually usable, and that's the important part. It, it's not going to just sit there and click on you. With a little bit of practice, you can move some stuff with it. I'd say loose dirt, loose gravel. Probably nothing too, too, too heavy. But all right, thanks for checking out this uh, little new Huina bulldozer. We'll be seeing more of it in the future. I got a few plans for it. I kind of like to take this whole cab area off and add a seat and then just an overhang and put like a, the 116 scale uh, brooder figures in there. So that way he's just kind of like an open cockpit on a little bulldozer. But well, thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. Hope you enjoyed the video and I hope to catch you on the next one. Yeah.